By the end of the battle, the French had lost about 377,000 soldiers to death and injury, and the Germans had lost 337,000 soldiers. German Chief of General Staff Eric von Falkenhayn had intended to ruin the French army, but he had not expected the huge German losses as well. The battle had a huge impact on the rest of World War I. The French army had taken so many casualties that the British military led the rest of the war, including the big push on the Western Front. The scars of the war can still be seen and felt today in France. People are still digging out 40 tons of unexploded artillery shells every year. The landscape around Verdun was forever scarred, and the people of France still remember Verdun as the bloodiest and most costly battle of World War I.